be turning the tables, working out which one is your favourite. But in the meantime, here's a couple that hooked up on Taken Out. Would you like to go on a date with Lachlan? Yes, I would. Let's have a great day. Well done, Amy. Thank you. I wasn't disappointed with the options I had. I was glad that I was going on a date with Lockie. Back in the love shack, I felt a connection. There was no awkward silences. I didn't feel that I had to sit over the other side. I was looking forward to going on a date. She's a lovely girl. The date. I got to Electric Ladyland and I sat there for a little while. I kept her waiting, which I feel bad about. I was probably waiting maybe 15, 20 minutes. I think it might have uh, heightened her sense of excitement, just the build up. And maybe she thought I wasn't going to come anyway. So then when she saw me, she's like, Yeah, your lucky's here. How exciting. How are you? Did you did wear your suit. Sorry to keep you waiting. It was good to see him. I laughed because he had his suit on, which he said he was going to wear, and he had the handkerchief in his pocket. I'm glad I wore a suit because she was dressed quite well. Then we had a, a chat. He would just throw in a joke just out of left field. What was your name again, sir? <laughs> so we were both laughing and it wasn't so awkward. Uh, ordered another drink. I sort of leant over the bar and exposed my back side, which is one of my strong points. And I think she noticed that. I think she thought it was quite attractive. Look, he came over and gave me the drink, and as he passed it to me, he tipped it. Oh, thanks. Oh, wait. That's when the jack of all trades, the handkerchief, came out. Hold on. You've got your handkerchief. He actually rubbed my leg after I'd already got rid of it. I don't know whether she appreciated that. All in all, I think it was a successful date. I was heartbroken that the date was over. I was just getting started, and I think she was too. At the end of the date, we got an opportunity if we wanted to go to the rendezvous point. The decision to see Amy was an easy one. Amy wasn't there when I arrived, so I thought I'd pop the champagne myself and have a glass. I thought she would come, but then I started having doubts. When I saw Amy, I felt accepted, not rejected. It was relief, sort of realised there was obviously something there. Cause he did the old yawn and reach over and put his arm around me. I am attracted to Lockie. Very attracted to Amy. She could be my special friend. Hi Lockie, thanks for the date. You're a very funny guy. I'd like to see you again, so I'm leaving your light on. As the 20th century philosopher Billy Joel once said, what a lady, what a night. Amy, your light is on. She's just a